everyone, so today I am going to be doing a Disney haul. I'm really excited. Guys, I have some pretty awesome products that I've been saving up to show you guys. Like, they're pretty awesome. I'm so excited. And I actually have a couple things that are still coming in. Um, so I'll try and do a separate video for that because it'll just be, I ordered three shirts, no, two shirts, two shirts, and then like, I can't even remember what I ordered. I think I ordered a couple wax melts and like candles from Walter and Rosie, but I can't remember for sure. I can't remember. So I'll have to see. But whatever I get from there, I'll just do like a mini haul. It'll literally probably be like a three minute video. But I can show you guys anyways because I think it'll be fun. But first, let's just get into this video because I have a couple things for sure that I want to want to show you guys. So first, um, let me just show you the new Tsum Tsums that I got. So I got two new Tsum Tsums. I got these from Walmart because they were on sale for like $2.99 and I think Tsum Tsums are usually like five something. So I got the Mickey one and I got him because I had Minnie Mouse and I just wanted the original Mickey so I got him. And I also got Maximus which I think is <laughs> literally so cute. He might be my favorite Tsum Tsum that I have so far. He may be. Um, yeah, I think they're really cute. I don't typically like go out and spend a ton of money on Tsum Tsums. I usually only buy them if they're on sale on the Disney store because I literally got like most of mine for a dollar something. Um, but I, I won't typically buy them full price. So I just, they're just a little thing that I kind of like collecting, but, and I've gotten quite a few of them so far. I actually just got two Mohana ones in my uh, Mickey's Monthly box. No. <laughs> Mickey's mystery box. I keep saying Mickey's monthly box and it's not called that. I don't know why. But yeah, if you guys like Tsum Tsums, but you just don't really want to spend a ton of money, just wait for them to go on sale because most of the time they do. You might not get like the exact ones you want or if you want that, like sometimes they sell out quickly. Like the Beauty and the Beast ones, they, they sold out quickly. Or like if it's a new line, they sell out quickly. And sometimes you just have to wait. Um, but yeah, like I never thought I'd find Maximus for two nine two eighty eight or something. So yeah, I'm super excited oh, about those. I can add them to my little Tsum Tsum collection back here. It's really growing. I'm going to have to find a new spot. Okay, the next thing I have for you guys to show you is I bought this wax melt from Walter and Rosie Candle Co. And it was in, um, they were collabing with Oh Yeah, Dis or Oh Yeah Apparel. I always say yeah, Oh Yeah Disney. So I got theirs. I pre-ordered it. Um, this smells really good, but what's funny is it kind of reminds me of Christmas. I don't know why. It just kind of reminds me of like the Christmas tree smell, but it's not, it's not as Christmassy, but it, I feel like it has that kind of scent to it. So that's what it kind of reminds me of, but I think it smells really good. I've actually only used one because I'm trying hard not to use them all up, but, um, I'm really excited. I think it's super cute. I just had to get it. The wax melts are always a lot cheaper than the candles, so if you're not sure if you're going to like the scent or not, I definitely recommend buying wax melts first. That way you're not spending $18 on a candle and you're not loving it because um, these are like $5 or $8 or something. $5? I can't remember. So they're not very expensive. So I definitely think if you want to try them out, try the wax melts out first, unless you're for sure. And I bought candles and I wasn't even sure, but I bought them because... Did I get them on sale? I might not even got them on sale. I might have just bought them because I wanted them. I can't remember which ones I got either. Okay, and then I'll go ahead and show you guys the candles I got from Spireside Candles. So I got four of them. The first one I have is Splash Down. And this smells really good. What's funny is it does smell like water. But I don't really know if it smells exactly like the Splash Mountain ride. I just can't. It does, it has a little bit more of a musky scent to it because a lot of the water rides at Disney are more of like musky scented. Um, but it does smell really good. I really like this one. It's not my favorite of the ones I ordered, but I love Splash Mountain and I think I just love that it says Splash Down. That it just, it, it makes up for it. So the next one I got is Churros and I bought this because Cody loves Disney Churros. And this one smells exactly like a churro, like exactly. And I'm kind of, picky about my cinnamon kind of scents. Um, sometimes they're too strong, sometimes they're not strong enough, sometimes they just smell funky. This smells awesome. I really like this one. This is one that I would definitely, like, I would buy this one again because I think it smells that good. Um, and since I don't typically like a lot of the cinnamon scents, since I found one that I do like, I would buy this one again. Okay, the next one I have is the Black Pearl. And I have wanted this candle forever forever and this smells really good it does have that kind of water ride scent to it um 
I do, I do like this candle a lot. I think it smells good. It's almost got more of a masculine scent to it, which makes sense because Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, and I just think it's so cute. I love that it's black. I love that. It's just, it fits so well. So well. Okay, and then the last one I got, this was my, this is my favorite one. I got the Floridian candle, and the Grand Floridian has been one of my favorite resorts for such a long time. I've never stayed there. But this candle, <laughs> this candle smells just like the Grand Floridian. When I smell this, I feel like I'm walking through the doors when I get off the monorail, and that big whiff of the Grand Floridian scent comes rolling over into your nostrils. Like, this is what this smells like, and I just... I just can close my eyes and just imagine myself there. And then I can just like imagine myself sitting down there in the big lobby and like looking up. And I don't know. I This candle, I love this candle. And the color of it's really pretty as well. So this one I definitely recommend if you love the Grand Floridian. You're going to love that candle. Okay, the next thing I got, this is kind of, um, well there's still water in it because I was using it. This is the Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival tumbler um the turvis is that how you call what you call them i've been wanting this forever and i finally just bought it it was like 20 dollars or something on the disney parks app i love this thing i did not think it would actually do as well at keeping things cold as it does but it actually doesn't do a pretty bad job um i say my drink stays pretty cold most of the day it's not like ice cold or anything but it does stay cold to where when you drink it, it's a little bit more refreshing. And I love it. It has figment up here. It has Minnie Mouse up here. And then it has like a little deer down here. It just, it's so cute. It has figments and it has Minnie Mouse. And I love the colors. It's very aesthetically pleasing. And it just kind of brought a little bit of Flower and Garden Festival to me since I didn't get a go. Um, I really wanted one of the Dunia Burks from that collection. But it, those are just so expensive that, and I have something I'm about to show you anyways, that... I kind of was like, you know what, I'll just settle for this, I'll buy this for myself, so I bought this, and I, 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 I love it. I'm obsessed with it. Okay, so the next thing I have is actually from Oya oh yeah Apparel, because I can't help but buy things from them. The first shirt I got is Race You Down Main Street, and it is this really pretty mint green color. Oh, I have makeup on it, please disregard my makeup situation, I'll have to get it off. I wore it the other day, so, uh, but yeah, they were on sale. So I went ahead and picked this one up because I had been wanting it forever. This wasn't particularly the color I was wanting, but actually I had not seen this color. So when I seen it, I was like, you know what? I'm getting that because that's super, super cute. And then the, ne the next one that I got, and this is the last one of those, and there's hair on it because once again I wore it. Um, it is a tank top from them. It's a little wrinkly, but it says Dreaming of Far Off Places. And this was in their Beating the Beast collection when the movie came out. So I thought this was really cute too. Just a plain gray tank top and their shirts and tank tops are so comfortable so the next thing that i have is by daniel daniel nicole and um it is the cinderella purse and i love it it's got the little chain um and i've had this for a little while i just i forgot that i didn't show it in my last disney haul didn't i post it i did i think so um, and isn't this beautiful? Look at the back of it. It's so sparkly. It's gorgeous. So this was, I think, $68, but I think I got it on sale. Like, I think I had a coupon or something, or maybe, maybe not. I can't remember, but, um, at my first, like, my new job, one of my first paychecks, I bought this because I wanted one so bad, and, like, I want all of them because they're literally, the whole Disney collection's beautiful, but I was really excited to get Cinderella. I think Cogsworth is really cute. Um, they have a Seven Dwarfs or a Seven Dwarfs one now that's really cute. They have so many out that I'm like, oh, I want them all, but there's so many. Um, so, but I got Cinderella. She's one of my favorite princesses. I do love Cinderella. I love Belle. Um, I just, but I do, and I love Rapunzel, but I do love Cinderella. She's like in that top three. So I got that one. And then the last thing that I'm going to show you is probably my favorite thing that I've gotten so far from Disney for a while. And Cody actually bought this for me just as a random present. But it is a Dooney and Burke crossbody. And it's so beautiful, guys. I'm absolutely in love with this. So in love. Um, I've been wanting to start collecting the Dooney and Burke Disney purses. And, like, this one was, I think, $168.00. And it's not as bad as most of them because most of them are really expensive. But, um, it's actually got a lot of room in it. Um, so I really like that. I think it's a lot more roomy than what I thought it was going to be. So it's, yeah, it's beautiful. I'm so excited to use it. I love it so much. I'm just, uh, if it's Disney, Disney and Burke, I want it. I want them all. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed my Disney haul. Please comment and subscribe below and hit that thumbs up if you like this video so I know to film more of these kinds of videos. And I hope you guys have a magical day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.